Hello and welcome to Features and Facts of WinC Open Architecture. This is your host, Marcus. Today I'm going to show you something about 3.19 version. Did you know that in the 3.19 version we can now have an alert delay configured on our alert handler? Let me show you how to do. As you can see, the default setting for the alert handler does not show any delay, but we can now select in the combo box not only value hysteresis, but the new feature timely hysteresis. When we do that, we can see in any of the select uh, ranges a specific delay in seconds, of course. In our example, we use five second delay. And when we activate this, then of course we are going to test that immediately. And what we're going to see when I now set the value that nothing happens in the alarm screen. We have to wait the five second delay and then of course we will see the message. Now, when there is just the short peak um, over the limit and then we come back to the other range, of course there is nothing that can happen of course multiple times. Yeah? No matter how often when the five second is not reached, nothing will happen. That's exactly the reason why we have the delay. And of course, when we wait for the five seconds, we will see the message in the alarm screen. Please note that the time stamp when the alarm is created is of course the delayed timestamp. So that is why we see here nine seconds, uh, but the value changed, it happened five seconds earlier, so the four seconds. Of course, that feature works for all data types and even for discrete alerts. That's all what I have for you today. See you next time. Have fun with Windows COA.